Hello everybody and welcome back to my Fallout New Vegas playthrough. Well, last time we had gone ahead and finally reached the Think Tank. As well as took like 40 minutes just to talk with everyone. At least just the start of it. We still haven't even actually chatted with people. Hey, what you doing? Are you being that bastard that hasn't subscribed yet? Well, why don't you join one of us that have subscribed? As well as that, you might as well tune down to the description down below where I have a new subreddit called uh, r slash realmhq. Other than that, back to your regularly scheduled program. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, can you speak? Do you understand me? Did something happen with your voice module? Uh, that is, uh, too bad, or good, or something? Hmm. Pretty sure you under can understand me. I want some answers. Hmm. Who are you? Sounds important, I think. Do you know anything about Dr. Mobius and the Forbidden Zone? Alright, alright, just calm down. Didn't mean to alarm you. Can you tell me about these technology Klein wants? You sound agitated. Or you're percolating. Or something. Tell me about the Big Empty. need to be indignant, just was asking a question. Wait, after listening a bit, that's Robco Termlink protocol you're broadcasting, right? I'm just full of surprises. Eh, <laughs> nice pun on the header ref file. I agree, if someone would take the time, you're more than just sound effects in a tank. If that's Robo Term Link Protocol, doesn't that mean it can be hacked? <clears throat> if, it, if that's Term Link code, don't worry, I'm not going to take advantage of your exposed code. Not a problem. I know what it's like to be experimented on. Uh, about when I first arrived, tell me you didn't sonjaculate into my... my sonic emitter? Well, there had to be some other way to fire it up. Can we at least talk about it another, or over it next time? Now that we know each other better, can you tell me about the Sonic Meter? Huh, really? Higgs Village? Can you plan it out, my Pip Boy? So, your house is there? So, there's a meter coast, or there's a meter code in your house in Higgs. Oh, two codes one for the jukebox and one for the opera. Nice, I'll keep an eye out. I may have already picked no, I haven't even been anywhere. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'll be going now. 
Uh, okay. I wanted to ask you some questions. No. What is, uh... Oh, I think I might have fucked it up. Good to see you, eight. And I need discoveries today. Fuck. I think I did. There's an ability to talk to him about the song. Uh, trust me, I'll get the technology, right? Yeah, I think I closed it off. Fuck. So, there's something you can talk to O about in terms of the, uh, the emitter. In terms of how he actively got it fired up. Well, the problem is, is that I went ahead and shut down the conversation, so... There's a reason you don't just always go with, uh... The, the top one. I mean, it's good for this stuff. Uh, it's... It's an agitator, I don't know, I don't know. That is full of surprises. Uh, okay, not a problem. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, how did you fire up? Yeah. So, how did you fire up the Sunlight Better when I arrived again? Yeah, so, because that shuts down the conversation. Nothing to be embarrassed about, it's just the best. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't know if it actively does, but usually I just find some uh, cram lying around, put some duct tape around the lid, good enough. He's talking about making a really fun toy, essentially. Uh, now that we know each other better. Yeah, because I literally just shut down the uh, talk. Well, it's projector is kind of evident. A meta works better. Blah blah blah. Yeah, blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Nice to. Okay, I'll be going now. And then you can ask him the other stuff. Okay, so that takes care of that. We already robbed the place. I don't need to worry about Dr. Bowman! What other terrifying terrors will plague us in our quest for knowledge? Communists? Communist animals, perhaps? Be warned. Attempt to propaganda me. I will shriek as a frightened babe calling loyal cyber dogs to my aid. Do you comprehend, commie Come animal? Animal? Did you just call me an animal? Yes, animal. Hormones, pores, glands, all wrapped up in skin. Who knows what terrifying secrets lie beneath your epidermis? Scalpels shall tell us your secrets, even if we must cut deep for such knowledge. I was head of my biology class at American High, you know. Okay. Who are you? What are you doing around here? Before you is the brain of Dr. Boros, head of animology, bestology, and DNA scrambling technology here at Big Mountain. I lay the bones and hearts of animals bare beneath my searing gaze, especially the dogs. I did so love dogs once, especially Gabe, that rascal. But there are many animals to shape. Industrious Cazadors, the happy-go-lucky Night Stalkers. They what? are my living, breathing DNA test tubes. You're responsible for the fucking Cazadors? Indeed. Docile. Curious. No. Safe, sterile. They are contained here at Big Mountain. No, they fucking aren't. To preserve DNA and for observation. What makes you think they haven't escaped? Contained at Big Mountain? These things are all over the damn mall, are they? No, such creatures are found only here. For what research you talking purposes, about? they would no more be capable of escape than breeding. 
I don't think they're sterile. They breed all right. I cannot expect a lobotomite to I've seen their fucking the nests. surgical castrating procedures used in their creation. Perhaps a demonstration of my castrating power would settle your doubts. Go on, go ahead. You'll make me more fertile or impregnate me. Impregnate you? What? Do you want to make me vomit inside my tank? The mere notion makes the edges of my biomed gel crystallize into asymmetrical patterns. You don't seem to have a grasp on your own research. Nonsense! That is what you speak. Nonsense! From beyond! I was at the top of my high school class in American high school. I knew facts. I knew figures. I knew data. We would know if our research was flawed. It is not. We never contradict ourselves. So do not even try. All right. So you created the Caz or when did you create the Cazadors? In 2000, let's see, carry the three, then count backwards with the great static, or beyond. There were the tarantula debates, and something about hawks, which made it around. Uh, 2003, May, Tuesday, uh, it was definitely Tuesday. Why are we even debating this? What you ask is of These no like importance. Mobius besieges us. There are more important things to worry about than data and facts. Okay, I want to know more about... Well, actually, can I... Night Stalkers? Those crazy coyote snake things? Indeed. Docile. Curious. Safe. Sterile. They are contained here at... What makes you think they haven't escaped? Because big mountain safety measures are far more sophisticated than their primitive animal instincts. We are their lords and masters. I had other questions. Submit your questions. I shall respond with deadly answers. Okay, I want to know about more about Mobius in the Forbidden Zone. The malignant tumor that is Mobius plagues us all. His hunger for power, insatiable. From his lair in the Forbidden Zone, his terrifying robo-scorpion army clicks and whirs across the crater of Big Mountain, ever seeking, ever stinging. He must be stopped. Or all of Big Mountain shall be destroyed. Tell me more about this radar fence around the crater. The radar fence protects us all. If evidence is correct, the one who built it is me. It keeps anything with a disembodied brain inside, like us. And anything without a brain, also inside. It is the ultimate defense against communist aggression. There'll be no infectious ideas on my watch. The fence doesn't make much sense to me. It makes perfect sense. Who are you to question the mighty radar fence? Ever since my anxiety-filled days of powerlessness and being bullied in American high school, I have dreamed of such security as the fence. That and giant cybernetic dogs that would ruthlessly patrol and kill anyone who wasn't my friend, like Richie Marcus and Betsy Bright. Wait. Who's laughing now, Betsy? I hope you and Richie are happy smoking in your radioactive coffins. I'm glad you never came to my birthday party. I just realized something. Fucking American High? They talked about the fact that X8 or whatever the fuck it is, is supposed to be a high school. If you remember, the motherfucking survivor and the children of the sorrows... Well, 
they came from a fucking high school. And last I checked, his rifle was still with me. I think I've made up my mind for the ending of the Steel Sea. Dr. Mobius may be... His fate may not have been decided yet, but yours... Yours may as well. Anyway, you don't want to leave here? No! Beyond is death, despite mounting evidence to the contrary. No matter where these strange humans wander in from with their ideas and new brains, there is nothing beyond Big Mountain. Evidence to the contrary? Enough! Stop filling my precious brain cell units with irrelevant data. You sound like the other visitors, making wild claims of a world beyond, right. where there is a war beyond war. It is unproven and unthinkable. Bother the other doctors with your crackpot theories. I have no time. None of us do. Okay, so here's the problem. Dr. Boris is an asshat. Dr. Klein's an idiot. <sighs> but that means that fucking Dr. O, Dr. Darla, and Dr. Eight should live. And if I want... Fuck. I can't kill them. If I kill these two, then the other ones will die. Why does Klein want these particular technologies? There is logic and purpose in it. If these technologies are needed to pierce the forbidden zone, so be it. Science is powerful, and in the right hands, our hands, if we had hands, we would be nigh unstoppable. Or what's the thing? Klein... I don't know, he's somewhat redeemable. Dr. Boris ain't. Especially what the fuck he does with Gabe. Can you tell me about the Big Empty? That castrated nickname of our facility is not its true name. The true name is... Big Mountain. Where are your manners? It is our home. Threatened by the horrors of Mobius. All we wish to do is continue our research. Layer upon layer, above and beneath the floor of the crater, until we have our answers. But no, Mobius will not let us rest, scaring us with his scary robots with their laser tails and blowing up all the time. How? Uh, why do you love this place? It was not our first choice of testing grounds, but we no longer have the luxuries of our test cities. Then we lost the mountain. After the explosion, we couldn't find it anymore. So the crater became our testing grounds for science. Test cities? Yes. In the past, individuals would come to us, pay for technology, and if their town, community, or city was just right, we could use that city as a controlled experiment. Vault-Tech was much better at it, of course. We had to make do. Get permission. Sometimes. If only we could have used commie cities. But capturing whole cities was hard, so we captured enough commies to make cities of our own. So we had a group of Chinese prisoners to experiment on. Those were the days. But the true test was science on unsuspecting Americans. The Whether fuck? it was holograms, new autodocs, toxins, vending machines, we wound them up, let them go into tiny, isolated towns. Then, we observed. What was the explosion? What was this explosion? Boom! Yes, quite unexpected and embarrassing. All better now after the landscaping, though. Much more pleasing to our monitors. And the crater helps keep everything inside, because it is bowl-shaped. 
I'm just like this is bullshit. Never mind, we've spoken enough. Until next time, then. Provided there is a next time for any of us. <laughs> You're lucky you cannot be fucked with right now. Pressing V as hard as I can. <clears throat> Alright, well, I've done really all the much talking I want to do with these guys. Or no, there's the other two. Of the other three we need to check in with, but ugh, fucking hell, this is so much talking. I'm just itching to go put down something because of these jackasses. <sighs> Alright. Fuck's sake. Alright. They gave me a sink thing or whatever the fuck they gave me. You probably take. Okay, the Sonic Emitter Revelation now available from the vendor and your plate. Salutations and felicitations, sir, and a most jocund welcome to the sink. I am your electronic valet and household central processor. May I be of service, sir? Are you some kind of artificial intelligence? Regrettably not, sir. All modules and habitat are synthetic personalities atop a mundane operating system. There is no intelligence here, sir. I mean, you're not kidding. I mean, there are other personality modules here? Indeed, sir. Though if sir's aim is to activate them, I lament to inform, sir, that most have been offline for some years. If sir were to ask my opinion, I should venture that sir is better off without them. What are you talking about? If sir is determined to inflict upon sir's self their dubious services, sir might locate backup personality disks elsewhere in the facility. Why is that? The other modules are rather erratic, sir. Their personality matrices are built on flawed logic and have not weathered the years well, sir. Okay, so can I access their functions without loading their personality hall tapes? Tragically, the core operating systems are also located on the personality tapes, sir. Once the tape is installed, sir may request I switch their dialectic interfaces off, and I shall oblige with great delectation. Mm. However, sir will still be required to locate and install a backup hollow tape to access their functionality. Okay, why are there so many personality modules? As I am given to understand, sir, this facility was once the property of a Dr. Mobius. He crafted the personality modules as part of a collection of experiments on the subject of machine-human interface. As to the reason for the unusual choices of devices to receive the modules, I cannot say. We did find a toaster. Let me ask you something else. Indubitably, sir. What kind of service do you provide? In addition to managing the personality matrices of the other household utilities, I can provide, sir, with direct access to the commissary. Any goods sir might require may be purchased through my shopkeep interface, whence tiny robots shall deliver them forthwith to this very domicile. Hmm. Need my equipment repaired. Very good, sir. Let's see. Yeah, there isn't anything outright I would like to get repaired. It'll definitely your cost, but I can just supply or some or just go past it with the other stuff. I'll have to get you repaired down the line, but not now. I did have a ton of those scrubs, so... Dr. Mobius. Gobbles. Scrubs. These scrubs. I uh, know. The mad scientist scrubs. I be of service, sir? Uh, I'd like to buy some things. Very good, sir. And might I venture to opine that a new trilby might be just the thing to complete sir's all sorts? I'm not gonna become a redditor, pal. Alright. Let's see. Special round? Interesting. <laughs> yeah, like I say, I'm not going to be able to top off on my explosive rounds. So 
So whatever I got right now will be until I can get more ammo. Oh, the BBs in the well. He really doesn't have shit. Okay, ammo wise. Or not just ammo wise. Ooh. That looks good. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, he really doesn't have anything. I'll buy that, but that's kind of the whole fun part. That I actually haven't bought enough. The fucking. I could probably offset it with something else, but I'd actually be operating at a loss if I just straight went into it. Dirty water, cream, buff out. Let's see. Medics, mentats. Yeah, I'm gonna be operating at a loss, ain't I? Yeah, you're gonna have to give me some stuff to offset the cost. Because I got a ton of shit to fucking give you. I don't even know, fucking. That's the main issue. Like, I'm legitimately having to fucking make sure I don't operate at a, co at a loss. I'm probably just gonna have to buy a shit ton of the ammo. I may end up <laughs> buying this guy out for crying out loud. I'm sure when we reach the more uh, explosive stuff. Should about cover it. Let's see. Well, a lot of primers. I wonder what I can make here. I could definitely recycle a bunch of ammo. Wait, what? Meals to metal? Wait, what? Does this just give me metal? That's a time bomb. Uh, is there anything else? That. Okay. Ooh, coin shot. We do have a good chunk of that shit. <sighs> anyway, uh, let's break down. If you can craft the fucking I don't well there definitely are some rounds so I could see about possibly making explosive rounds if I just pick up the mad bomber I think I actually may look into that Fallout New Vegas Explosive .50 Can you craft it? Blah, blah, blah. 
A weapon production standard and match can be crafted. Okay, incendiary. So you can't craft that one, and you can't craft the other one. Okay, great. So, yeah. So, when I run out, I run out. Let's hope I don't. Anyway. And looted gear. Oh, what are we missing? Rifle ammo. Oh, fuck. Okay. Let's hold off on that. Got pistol ammo. Powders for pistol. Okay, I have a 12 and a other one, so... The 12 actually doesn't need any. Because we have so much of it. So let's make the buckshot, and I'll make the 50. And that pretty much will cover it for now. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Swap it to that. I have over 500 rounds. Ooh, it makes a little bark sound. Just need to repair stuff. Right. That one. Let's go repair that. Did that bring it all the way up? Looks like it didn't, yeah. Alright, and survival's rifle. How many ran? Oh, yeah, we got a good chunk. Alright. I should probably go ahead and equip you. And let's get you. And let's do you. So there's that. There's the you. There's the Gauss rifle. Oh, it just cost you five. Okay. Bulk. Charged. Okay. And Goss. Ooh, look at this thing. That's cool. That's cool. Aw, it makes a little sound when it goes away. So these do run off a of different ammo. Ooh, interesting. Alright, well, let's work with you right now. Alright, now that we get all that stuff done, let's actually go do some shit. So just stand around talking. Apparently there's nothing in the sink I can do. And the only quest I got right now is just go uh, fight. So yeah. Oh, this door open. Would you look at that? It's my spine. Here's your spine. Without a brain stiff, a snap on it's it onto. Here it floats. Your back doesn't feel any different from the spine removal. If anything, whatever was placed there makes you feel stronger. So am I actively stronger, or is that just I've already yeah I've already kept myself out. Based on the other tanks in the room, you can safely assume this would uh, this is where your brain would be floating. It's currently missing from both the tank and its proper place in your head, but you seem to be doing fine without it. This would be where I place my brain. If I had it! <laughs> as well as my nun! If I had it! Hey look, it's my heart. This is your heart. Apparently, cranial surgery complications require its removal. And until your brain is returned, your heart can't be trusted to keep beating your body. Your new heart seems to be working just fine, however. Alright. Edotronic. Fancy lad snacks. Alright, well, we either go to the think tank or big empty. Let's head down to the floor. Ooh, there's some blue grass. Man, this whole place, I haven't discovered anything. 
So there's X8. That's X2. X13. Hmm. I get told. Uh, yeah, there's the X8. Higgsville. Ooh. I know uh, Dr. 8 was talking about that. So let's head down there. Really, nothing here yet. So, see, this place seems at least abandoned. Oh, there's somebody over here. Ooh. Lobotomite doesn't have a head anymore. I guess he should get ahead of himself. Let's swap to our match looted. Need some ammo and nothing else too much to know. I got it here and it's not even that high up. <clears throat> Sorry, the radio player keeps just down, 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 down. Hmm. What was Hicks Village again? That's that place. Okay. Alright, let's go explore. Have some lobotomites. Wouldn't be a bad idea to go at least hit up there as well. So. Seriously, there really ain't too much out here. I don't know why the hell they couldn't come out here. Okay, like, no joke. Where the fuck is everyone? This place is usually. Oh, there we go. Fuck, that was a miss. What was that? Did you really just tank another round? That was a leg. And you're tough. Never mind. Wait, I think I hit his hammer out. If you see your robo scorpions, do not attempt to fight them. They will shoot you with their robotic stingers, and then possibly explode. Alright. Okay, I'll keep an eye out for them. Okay. 
the guy's just on fire, like, what? He doesn't even care. <laughs> He's just like, ah. Well, I appear to be cooking. Eh. Okay, so that is where I gotta aim. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Oh, I'm shooting AP, that's why. I don't think so, pal. Can't out snap me, pal. There's something down there. <clears throat> hey, a revolver. Okay. Oh, you can access the electro boxes. Okay. I don't know if I killed it. Ooh, Ulysses Point. Hmm. The hell, these blue. I wonder what the hell these blue signs mean. It kind of looks like it's the Star and Stripes, but like from the old days. At least pre war. Huh. Doesn't seem to be any enemies in here. No, oh, just a casual rig. Um, nothing about this use. I'll take the fungi though. They were a pound though, but still. Bobby pin the right away. Purified water. That reminds me. Ooh, patient log. Point five, five point nine, or one seven nine, or whatever the hell it was. There's a radio. There's binoculars. Somebody was here before me. I know Elijah said he was here, but and I think didn't Christine say she was hunting Elijah? She probably was here too. Gun case. Case. Right. Hmm. Nothing else to note outside of a couple of first aid boxes. <laughs> Bobby Pin, <Payne>, rebound, <laughs> steam packs. Hmm. Let's see. What the fuck is on these tapes? 
Occupation log 5.5. Hey, there's from my cold, dead hands. Howdy diddly do. Don't want to argue philosophy with you. Brotherhood are preservationists. Tech in the wrong hands, it's dangerous. Mojave's proof. No denying that. Proof's here in this crater, all around us. Your tribe, the Brotherhood. Haven't met many of you. Wanted to. Thought you might be the last chance for the Mojave, the West, the East. But you're all the same mind. Obsessed. Elijah is obsessed. He's mad. It's why so that's Christine. Two are more alike than you know. Two wrapped up in the wrong bits of history to see ahead. Not judging. I know how it is. People are like couriers. You and him sometimes don't even know the message they bring. You all had a new flag. Thought maybe new ideas along with it. What you believe isn't any better than the bear or bull. No future in either. So says the man with the old world flag on his back. America, the Commonwealth, burned away. America sleeps. And until it's dead, I carry it. Just like I carried you. More than hope. Belief. There's voices here in the big empty. I want to talk to them. Not like your Elijah did. Got questions? Want to hear history give its answer? Huh. So we'll need to talk to Dr. Klein about that. Sounds like whoever the hell was speaking with Christine. Got some info. I don't know if they really, really want him to have it. Okay, what about the second log? Didn't think you'd make it back. Almost didn't. Got my answers. You're Elijah. He met the gods in this place. Did a good job of making them question the way of things. Do you know where he went? He's gone to the Sierra Madre. That's a special kind of hell. There is no standing on the green pipes. If you are standing on the green pipes, please get off them at once. If the Madre doesn't. I have to go after him. Not going to talk you out of it. Know what it means to track someone you share history with. Got a meeting of my own. That courier? Get him to come to me. Got a message for him. Like the message he had for me. Make them walk Ooh. the road west, straight and true. Sink their feet in old world ash. Let storms tear at them. See the divide. See what happened. The divide? There's nothing there. Nothing there. Like the big empty. The Sierra Madre. No. The old world sleeps there. Sure as the flag I carry, the courier knows the way. And at the divide, he and I Okay. So he's wanting to speak with me. Is he tied? can't find that one, okay. Well, that's why there's been r radio playing the entire time. I didn't realize I had the radio on. Such a soothing music. Alright, so... That's somebody who have to fight. I think. I don't know. Talked about the divide, but <clears throat> the only place I remember that is the place we saw something about Courier Six. Ah, hey, what the? Hey, how's it going? The fuck is their goddamn death claw? Okay, I'm fucking. 
I'm a. You gonna fight me? Wait, what? What's the issue, bub? Apparently he was afraid of the fountain for some reason. Huh. Stripe. Got an egg timer on him. I guess this might be Dr. Boris's house? Yeah, that was Gabe's, so I probably see that. Chicken leg? What the fuck is this hellscape? Ooh, okay. 103. 108. 104. That don't make no sense. What the fuck? 10. Oh, it's 00. 101. Then 102. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There, no, there's five members. Maybe Dr. Mobius? They did say he, like, left. But Interesting. Alright, well, let's take what's in here. Dr. Mobius and his bottle caps. I know uh, 8 told us to come over here for some reason. Definitely is interesting finding some... Stuff like Stripe. What the fuck? Why was he here? Okay, enough playing around. I know why Stripe was here. He's part of the Wild Wasteland thing. So, initially, it's just supposed to say Gabe. But, because again, I have the Wild Wasteland in, uh, uh, Stripe appears. Stripe is a reference to the Gremlin movies. <clears throat> As shown, he actually does not like the fountain, and the reason being is because, uh, I, if I remember correctly, they're, they had like a, um, they had a uh, weakness to water. I don't remember if it was like, if they touch water, they die, or if it was something like, I don't know, I, I don't really care. All I know is that that's the actual reference. Definitely fun. Definitely fun actually doing this stuff. But yeah, I do appreciate you guys tuning in and all that jazz. Like, subscribe, comment down below. I'll see you guys next video. Other than that, have a great day. Where's the button? There's the button right there.